My First Bible Presents A Wife for Isaac A few years later, Abraham, already very old, said to his servant, I do not want Isaac to marry a Canaanite woman from this land. Mm -hmm. I want you to go to my country to find a wife for Isaac. The servant answered, Maybe the woman will not want to come with me to this land, so I should take your son there with me. No, be very careful not to take my son there, Abraham told him. The Lord God of the heavens took me out of that land and promised to me, saying, This is the land that I will give to my offspring. So God will guide you and send his angel before you, and from there you will take a woman for my son. But there's no way you will take my son there. Mm -hmm. This was a nearly impossible mission because there were too many women to choose the right one. Then the servant departed to the land where Abraham directed him. When he finally arrived, Stay here. the servant had the camel stay by a well. It was the afternoon when the young women went out to fetch water from the well. Then the servant prayed, God of my master Abraham, choose the woman that you know is right for Isaac. Please, tell me who it is. If I ask her for water and she says drink, and I will give your camels water too, then I'll know it's the one. Amen. After a while, the servant saw a group of young women heading towards the well. <laughs> The servant came over and asked them, Please, give me some water from your pitcher. This was the proof that he needed. And one answered, Drink, and I will also give water to your camels. Woohoo! The servant was very excited. It didn't take long for him to explain to her what his mission was. The young woman who had passed the test was named Rebecca, the one who would soon become Isaac's wife. The day that the servant and Rebecca with some of her servants arrived, it was evening time, and Isaac had gone out into the field to meditate. When he looked up, he saw the camels approaching. Oh, who is this beautiful woman? asked Isaac. At the same time, Rebecca saw Isaac and asked the servant, Who is that handsome man? That's Isaac. She immediately covered her face with the veil but his eyes sparkled when Isaac stopped the camel. It was love at first sight. God knew exactly who could take care of Isaac and who could take care of Rebecca. Hey, comment and subscribe below.